video game franchise okay we celebrated 30 years that's Mortal right. Kombat it's time for Mortal Kombat let's go right off the gate couldn't keep you waiting on this one it has been four years since MK11 and ever since Ed Boon and the team at NetherRealm have been hard at work on the most ambitious MK yet that reboots the series into a new era timeline and okay. it's coming this September. Everyone has been asking, what does it look like? Who's on the roster? How do the new cameo fighters work? Well, now it is time for combat. Show us. No spoilers, but this video no spoilers. is really insane. Let's go. It is an extended first look at the story gameplay and yes of course the fatalities yes Mortal Kombat yes let's go Ooh. okay we got Lou <laughs> there you go Ooh. I have had enough of you Oh, Sub Zero is gonna you fuck down, you right? up, Liu Kang. I'm sorry. Uh, you're way over your lead, buddy. Ooh, all right. He's holding his own, though. Ooh, okay. I said Lu. I meant to say Kung Lao. Oh, oh, that slide was epic. You have proven worthy of joining us. Come. There are other champions I must gather. Okay. What do you want? Sento. Oh! Kenchi! And I won't give it up without a- Who the fuck is that? Who is he fighting? Oh! Kenchi! Oh! He's fighting alongside Sub-Zero? What the fuck? Oh! Oh! My God! How is that not a fatality? Oh, that's Johnny Cage! <laughs> oh, shit! Okay, let's go back to one here. Who are you again? Lord Liu Kang, protector of Earthrealm, god of fire. No fucking way. Oh my god, Jax? Oh! Oh, oh, oh my god! Oh my god. Lu Kang, you can't fuck with Lu. You have skills, Raiden, but you're in Raiden? Whatever experience I lack, I make up for it. A young Raiden? Let's go! Sonya! Kano! Are they just gonna be cameo fighters? Like, not part of the main story and shit? Ooh! Oh my god, with the laser, bro. Oh my god, Raiden, chill! Fuck! If your disease becomes known, you will be banished. Ooh. I only want what's best for you. Or do you secretly covet my throne? Yeah, I... <laughs> Oh, Oh my god, let's go! Goro? Looking young? Oh, he got the classic Raiden. Yeah, suit on with the. Ooh. Oh, Striker! Striker makes it good, uh, like assist character only. Oh! Is that a fatality? Oh my gosh. Oh, Oh, fuck. Goddamn, Kano. Fuck, he's shit. Goddamn. God. Oh. He's, he's dead already. Goddamn. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, the classic. The classic, of course. Yo, that is ill. That is fucking ill. Shang Tsung Song, let's go. Yo, that's that shit is like a fire, bro. That shit is like a fire, bro. Well, that was pretty good, right, guys? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Now, I'm sure you have many questions about what we just saw, and to tell you more, 
I am so honored to welcome to Summer Game Fest one of our industry's greatest creators, a man who has been loyal to the same franchise and fan base for more than three decades. Please join me in welcoming to Summer Game Fest the creator of Mortal Kombat, Ed Boon! <laughs> Okay. Congratulations. <laughs> they love you. All right. Well, Ed, uh, first of all, thank you for that incredible uh, world premiere. We got to see all the gameplay of MK1. And everyone just wants to know more about this. Because first of all, this is in a, it's, it's MK1, right? It went from 11 to 1. So tell us about this. Is it a new timeline? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, I don't know how many people have seen the, the ending of Mortal Kombat 11. Liu Kang basically was kind of graduated into like... Graduated. Guy, right? and he's, he created Killed a everybody. universe. And this universe, this is why we're calling it Mortal Kombat 1, is because this is the beginning of a new timeline. A number of these characters you've seen before, but they're told in a completely different story. And so... Sub Zero and Scorpion are brothers now, and there's there's all these oh, things that okay. rivalries before are now allies, and so mixing the whole thing up, so we're just kind of rebooting, and that's what the one is for. Well, it looks okay. incredible. Everything we saw there was you know in-game gameplay. The cinematics look incredible. Uh, I know the team has been working for four years on this, but the thing we got to talk about are these cameos because we saw some pretty amazing stuff there. Now, so tell us how does that work? You obviously you have your sort of your main, you know, character that you'll pick, yep. and then I know you also Ooh, have a separate we're getting kind of like screen. Menu, so you pick sort of a pair when yeah. you start the game. Yeah, normally oh. in, in a fighting game, you'll you'll see a a roster basically, you know, where you select your character. After you do that, there's a Kenshi, second roster bro. of characters, which are a whole new, uh, completely different so. fighters that are the cameo fighters, and these fighters actually oh. they will join the fight. But they, a lot but of they, blank squares there. Yeah, so it's so, kind of like imagine yourself with Sub-Zero, but you have some of Jack's moves, and yeah. you can call him out. Oh, you can do it multiple okay. times, as you saw in the gameplay. You okay. know, So you can piece, you, you can basically combine these two characters. So all the characters play. can be combined with all the cameo fighters, and that's Ew. where you see Kano just that's where the like kind spit of it out and comes in. And you can actually customize it for what they like seeing, uh, you know, the, the best team-ups. Well, so how does that work? So you're in gameplay, you have your main, you have Ooh. your cameo. How do you, do you summon them? Is it time-based? Like, how often do they come in? To, like, it's not a tag team thing, right? Where yeah, still, yeah, exactly. And and you're you're basically summoning them. It's just one button. Push, come on, come on, full screen. There we go. Variety. So you can go. So you just know, R1 one button with to, to bring them. A different move, push it with down, oh, it'll do a different move. Okay. And so the combination. Oh, I see. So you can bring them in a combo. Almost. Exactly, exactly. Oh, and, and so, shit. And you see, there's like a meter up on top, uh -huh. which is basic. That, that'll limited Ooh. so you can't obviously fire them indefinitely but um you call you can call them pretty much whenever you want yo can she look have, sick you know, bro the combo, they'll have a lot of um oh you know basically a whole arsenal of their <laughs> moves so so when you saw come Ooh. out there sometimes you'll see them appear twice in oh there. oh okay they come out and then obviously as you go through you revealed some of them there, but are, it's a, is it a different Ooh. set of characters that will be in the cameos? Are there some repeats from the main roster? How will that work? Yeah, yeah. Some of the characters are going to be available as cameos as well as the main roster fighters. So you can play Sub-Zero with Sub-Zero, right? <laughs> <laughs> you, can play, you can, same thing with Scorpion. But a, a lot of That's our, cool. That's our cool. cameo okay. fighters are kind of like nods back to our uh -huh. first game. So you'll notice Sonya and Kano and Jax are in their kind of older costumes. And so there's there's a lot of that novelty. We have a lot of like really surprised ones. I think you you guys saw Goro. Yes, Goro was, was in, in there. there. Yeah, yes, yeah. Exactly. So yeah. so there's a lot of like kind of really digging into the old Mortal Kombat games as far as getting. That is you know, fire. Um, that is fire. We really love the novelty of it. We really want the cameo characters to feel, uh, you know, kind of nod to the old games. <laughs> well, speaking of uh, <laughs> not the old games, let's talk. You confirmed, I think, or at least known that Jean Claude Van Damme is actually going to be in this game as Johnny Cage, yeah. right? Yeah. Is that true? <laughs> yes. Yeah. That was yeah. people don't know the story. I mean, Bloodsport was such an inspiration for Mortal Kombat, so he oh, finally yeah. is now he's yeah, it, part it, of it. It's a huge first uh, full circle moment. You know, the the first Mortal Kombat game we originally wanted to be Van Damme the video game, and that and that never really worked <laughs> out. So I, I can't tell you how many times over the last thirty years we've tried to get him. Uh, you know, we were this close, yeah. like four or five times, and uh, so finally we got him, and he's doing the voices. Too. No, that's so you're cool. You're going to hear John Claude, his voice doing Johnny Cage lines and stuff like that. We're really excited about it. 
Wow. Well, I know the team has been working so hard in Chicago to build this through COVID, and it's coming out in September, so we don't have to wait long, right? That's right. With this, this has been a very difficult uh, secret to keep yeah. <laughs> over, the last, over the last four <laughs> years. And so, uh, but we're... We could not be more excited in terms of uh, getting players' hands on it. Um, and, you know, throughout the summer, we're going to be showing a lot more content, a lot more characters, a lot more cameo characters, you know, so there's a lot of reveals that are coming up. Amazing. Cool. Well, Ed, cool. thank you so much for giving us the first look at MK1. As you said, this weekend, people will be playing it, press and media, so we'll be seeing lots more coverage, lots more characters to reveal on the main roster and cameos. Uh, Ed Boone, thank you so much. First look at Warner Thank you. Awesome. Thanks so much. That was cool. That was cool. Amazing. So excited about that one. All right. Next up, it's been a fun couple weeks for action RPG fans with the release of Diablo 4, which is truly fantastic.